Hi, my name is Aim Skanda. Yes, tonight's video will be about RSA. I'm not referring to South Africa, but I'm referring to the Renault 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 Sports Academy. Okay. That I think is located in either in France, somewhere in France, or uh, is located at their Formula 1 base in Einstein, London. Okay. England, sorry. London is capital. So, yeah. Uh, okay, so. <coughs> so, yes. As you guys had known, I... Yeah. Uh... This Chinese national or this guy from China by the name of Guan Guan Yu Zhao, okay, is with the Renault Development Drivers Program or the Renaults uh, to make it easier, the Renault Renault Sports Academy. Or RSA. So, yes, RSA. So, yep. I, I either I did not notice or I really did not know about him joining. Uh, was snapped up by Ferrari's drivers. Uh, academy, uh, Ferrari. Uh, uh, Drivers Academy in mid the middle of 2014 until I think 2018 yeah, until the end of the year 2018 I did not know at all uh, yep Ferrari took him under their wing when he was racing in, in go-karts in 2014 then he graduated up into the ACDC championship okay that is the German Formula 4 Championship then if you are a Ferrari development driver you are either you must or you are compulsory to enter compulsory to enter the Italian FIA Italian Formula 4 Championship in Italy Yes, then after that he graduated up the ranks up the ranks again into the Formula European Formula 3 Championship Okay uh, Formula 4 and Formula Three, they have world championship basis. They have regi uh, they have regional basis, and they have European basis. Regional basis that means in one country only. European is the whole of Europe. World world is the whole world. Okay, for for Formula for Formula Three and Formula Four only. Once you enter Formula 2, you don't get that. You only get the World Championship. Okay, once you enter Formula 2. Because I remember that Danny Tickham, the former Red Bull Academy driver who is now with Williams as their Academy test driver and development driver was from the, champion, the same championship as Schumacher. Before he they graduated into F one, is the F I A Formula Three where championship, not the European Championship, World Championship, because they race in almost one or two countries that F one races in like Bahrain, like China, like. Azerbaijan, Spain, Monaco, 
in Europe, if it's European Championship, they will only race in one championship. Yeah, in the whole of Europe, that includes uh, England, United Kingdom that used to be a part of the European Union. Back to my video. So yeah, Guangzhou graduated there. Okay. Then he was signed up by, you know, the, uh, by this guy, by Renault as a development and reserve driver. Uh, actually, he was signed as by Renault as a development driver only, but he became reserve driver because of the the crash the fatal crash of Anthony 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 Hubert Anthony Hubert yes <laughs> I always have a problem pronouncing his name even though it's not even though I'm not doing this video Hubert is okay that his friend his first name Anthony 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 or Anton Anthony Anthony Hubert something yeah, Anthony so yeah I think Anthony is the right spelling eh yeah, 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 pronunciation sorry so yeah uh uh what again so yeah he was put in place as Renault's reserve driver uh, as early as I expected okay uh, not talk not referring to uh, the fr Frenchman who fatally lost his life in a crash but who the the Chinese national so if it would have if it would have been either at the end of this year or early last year that would have been understandable but I think Renault was forced to do that because they did not want the reserve driver's seat to be they wanted they wanted a con to be their reserve driver but a con was actually last year was actually connected with um the German outfit Mercedes Benz yes so they decided not to take the risk and put that Chinese guy but that Chinese guy by the name Zhao Zhao okay as a reserve driver if I'm correct but surely yeah I'm correct because the the a con was not released by Mercedes to test for to do testing for to do official testing for the team unless if it's a tire test then they will release a con to Renault but for any official test it requires a uh, not technology uh what do you call it that requires feedback from a con the the uh like let's say precision testing or uh, uh precision testing when the testing did not they did not allow a con drive the car drive the Renault last year drive the uh, drive the Renault last year because he he was contracted to the German outfit. Renault is not a German outfit, it's a, a French outfit, so yeah, so yeah, he was contracted to Mercedes-Benz, so he, was, he wasn't allowed, I think he did a few tyre tests with Renault and Mercedes-Benz, but other than tyre tests, he, he was not allowed to share any performance related feedback to Renault so that's why they decided to go for the for use Guan Yu Zhao to be safe 
So yeah, they they put Guan Yu Zhao as the reserve driver for last year. Okay. Uh, and development driver, but this year they have also announced that Yu Zhao would be Dia test driver for all their tests and maybe a few free practice one uh, free, pra- free practice one outings with the Renault team yeah but he might need to get enough points on his super license to do that yeah so yeah so yep Renault is was doing quite well uh, yeah with the uh, development of young drivers they don't over they don't mass produce at the time McLaren and Renault don't mass produce at the time unlike Ferrari unlike the top 3 teams like Ferrari Mercedes and Red Bull they tend to mass produce a lot of drivers at the same time aiming for two seats so it's tough for those type of drivers going in to those top two top three teams barring uh barring who's that guy Danny Tickham Danny Tickham was originally from that academy but with his bad performances in 2018 before he joined uh, Formula 2 uh, the Super Formula in Japan so he was uh, and uh, uh, in 20 sorry 2018 sorry uh, he joined Formula 2 last year okay he, he was in the Super Formula he was in the Super Formula under the under the under the license of Red Bull but because he had poor performances in his uh, super formula Red Bull decided to kick him out of the development setup I don't need to get further into that because I have a titled Red Bull Driver Mayhem video but uh, I think it's not related to Danoticum I think I have a video also 100% related to Tikka uh, yeah that's that the title of the video is uh, Tikka has uh, Tikka has no relations or Tikka no relations has no relations I think so yeah Tikka has no relations it's on my YouTube channel view that video yeah because in that video I actually was I talked I talked in depth about how Tikum got booted out from the academy. So I don't need to do the uh, I don't need to to reemphasize it because uh yeah it's a video about the China Renault is not a video about Red Bull anymore. Okay. So yeah. So, 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 yeah, so don't forget to watch that video and this particular video and my other uh, videos. I have a lot of them, so yeah. I have a lot of them. So yep, back to my video tonight, and yeah, hopefully, uh, when Yuzao gets a chance to to drive in F one, yeah, at least China has a participant in F one. 
Malaysia should have should have had it in 2010 or 2011 but thanks to our former premier uh, uh, former prime minister we did not get to see the first formula driver racing on the F1 grid after Alexio So yeah, I would like to say goodnight and stay tuned for my next video.